Actually, his third of fourth of four is getting ready now with that final XL. This is 24-year-old Candia Apariota, who's from here in Segulda. Her brothers, Christers, earned a podium earlier this year and then promptly broke his ankle and is out for the season. We'll see what Candia can do. She had a podium herself. I believe that was in Oberhof. Yes, it was a third place. Right, this is another athlete that has a lot of potential in today's race. Uh, she didn't have the best setup on the start ramp going in. She was a little bit too far left. It gave her a less than ideal angle, but she handled it very well. She's off to a pretty good start. Two career top three finishes for Kendia in World Cup, and the other one was here in Segulda. Wow, really high there. That you would not expect, Emily, uh, from the most experienced slider in this race on this track. You wouldn't, but it just shows how quickly and how easy, easily it is to make mistakes on this track. Very disappointing. It ju just makes for a disappointing weekend for the entire family. If Christer's missing the race, now Kendia will miss the second run. As, as you see from the graphic, she does not get a finish time. And right here, she had a pretty good exit. See that there's a long cross that she has over to 15, and I think it just caught her right there and then has an upward skid going up, and it's so challenging to get control when you're like that and see the turtle effect. You often see the, the slider hanging onto the sled. I don't see that much where the sled sort of provides a shield or a blanket. It was right on top of her. Unfortunate. Oh, my Unfortunate. heart goes out to her. Yep. That's, that's such a hard, hard position to be in, especially at a home World Cup, home European Championships. You have so, so many hopes in that, and that's definitely not how anyone wanted to see it go for. Just a moment ago, that was a look at Einars Vogelis, who is the new president of the International Luge Federation. And uh, it's been tough with the pandemic year in her, his first season at the helm. This is the first race he's had a chance to, uh, to watch. That's the mascot, Ricks. And Shiva is up early watching this morning the action. And uh, he said, let's hang out with some penguins here. There is, uh, there's Einars grooving to the tunes. The break, of course, Emily, is they always do a uh, an athlete check, a sled check, and, and most importantly for the other competitors, a course check after each crash. Right, especially you saw how um, Kendia had kind of that upward skid. So her sled was, was a little perpendicular to the ice of how you would want to see it. So there's a lot of chances for that to cut some ice to really kind of disturb the environment for the rest of the athletes that need to